everybody. Thanks for joining us again at He Works Hard for the Honey. Um, we've gotten to that point in the year where it's time for Varroa mite treatment. Um, and as explained in the previous video, what we're going to do is treat uh, every seven days for three weeks. And this will get rid of um, what happens to the Varroa is that they feed on um, the larva while it's capped. Um, so any Varroa that are coming out with bees um, that were capped during a previous treatment will eventually get hit uh, over the course of successive treatments. Um, what we do is we've got some, uh, some oxalic acid, 99.6% purity. I, I would probably not have bought a five pound bag if I had realized then I only needed two tablespoons per hive, but nothing succeeds like excess, I've been told. Um, and as a, a solution to sort of allow us to fog it, we've also got a grain alcohol, which is uh, 151 proof. Uh, and that's gonna give us the ability to sort of fog it. Um, I've already mixed it together, um, so we're going to be able to get right to work. I'll meet you guys over at Hive 1. <coughs> hey everybody and welcome back. Um, they are not tolerating me well. They are letting me know um, they are done with me being in their hive. Uh, and usually I would say to listen, but given that this is such an important treatment, uh, I'm probably going to get stung a couple times. They were not happy with me. You can see I put a, a barrier um, in between the brood chambers and the honey uh, because the oxalic acid... Uh, as I may have mentioned, gives spinach its bitterness. Uh, it would give our honey bitterness as well. And quite frankly, that looks like the sweetest honey I have ever seen. And I'd like to keep it that way. Um, so I'm just gonna stick right after. It gets away from me a little bit. We want to get the right in there. And we're going to give it one more. And that should take care of uh, the Varroa mites that are um, currently on the, the living bees. Um, oh my god, is that a drone? I thought they were all dead already. Um, wow, Mir miracles never cease. Um, <laughs> thanks for joining us, everybody. And um, I'm shocked I got away from that. Um, sting free. Uh, let's see if I'm as lucky on Hive 2. I'll uh, let you know if I see anything exciting, but in the meantime, uh, winter's coming, everybody. So we're going to be uh, winterizing the hives, putting um, some cardboard and uh, some styrofoam around the edges and some of the, uh, especially at the bottom of the hive to sort of keep those winter drafts out. Uh, and get these ladies ready to hunker down. I'm, I'm looking forward to and hoping to have um, a surviving, two surviving colonies this year. Uh, thanks, and we'll see you again soon.